Got the plate on and the grease. I went ahead and put two valves in the in the chamber because we're going to CC a chamber, the spark plug, and then we're going to roll it over and uh, and hit the exhaust. So we're going to record three volumes: an intake, an exhaust, and a chamber. Maybe an exhaust. I still ain't sure about that. But we do need to do a chamber where I had to cut all that meat out of it to get the spark plug to lay in right, which it just about laid in right on the money. All right, I'm going to go ahead and dump. 100 cc's maybe 200 then we'll come back for the final deal and let y'all see what it ends up at okay now i've got 200 cc's in it so let's uh finish it up and see just what we got here uh remember that it started life as 187 cc's they were supposed to have been 190s but they weren't is about 187. I averaged each head out at, at 188 because there was a couple of them that was 199, but one of them was 186. All right, so we're here for the final answer, and let's go. She's leveled at 200. Let's see what we got. Getting that last little bubble can be something sometimes. Alright, there ain't no more going in it. Alright, well, looks like we got 222.4. Alright, 222.4 cc's. And that's the number four port, by the way. So, 222 cc's, point four. That's from a 187. So, that was a 30 cc hit that we was able to get. That's a major port reshape right there. All right, so I'm going to stop for a second and go ahead and set it up. Uh, and what we're going to do now is we're going to hit the uh, combustion chamber side. We'll be interested to see what this is. Like I said, I know I cut the meat out of it and had to move that spark plug back, so hopefully it ain't too big. Alright, once again, chasing them damn bubbles. I've had to turn heads all the way upside down, and every, there we go. I think I just got it. All right, hold on. All right. 71 cc's. Right on the money. 71 cc's. That's on the combustion chamber. Okay, that's going to work real good with a 383. So, anyway, that's what we got on the chambers. I guess we could go ahead real quick and do an exhaust. Let me see if we can do one now. Now for the exhaust side. This is a little bit trickier. I'm going to drill me a bigger hole in this to let the air out of it. But anyway... Why not let you go ahead and see this all the way through? Remember, this is, I raised this roof at least a quarter of an inch the width. I really butchered this. The exhaust sides on the flow chart really, really flowed really good.
Hold on a minute, Dad, blame it. All right, there we go. All right. How about 77 cc's on the money? I got a little drop right there, and it'll probably fill the bubble that is in the corner, but it's pretty close. So I, it was 77.2. I'm going to call it 77 cc's. All right. So now we know our volumes and sonic testing and other stuff. So let's stop just a minute and do a couple of last-minute things. 